Academy Ender Accord. These came out in the Phantom Fire Pack. And I'm so excited to get on this video. Subscribe down below, turn on notifications, and like this video. As always, in the description I'll have the links to these shoes for Stockman.com. So go check it out. Let's go get into the video. And the box, you just get paper. Right here we have the Nike Phantom Venom Academy Indoor Court, and this was released in the Phantom Fire Pack. And here, for some reason, this looks really dark orange, but it's actually a really bright orange. And it's really cool. I love this color. One of my favorite colors. It's actually for retail, it's eighty dollars. But link in the description for Soccer.com, you can get them for just fifty. So really great price. The colors are are bright mango, orange pulse, and anth anthritic and white. So there you go. It looks really dark on camera, but again, it's really bright orange. Really cool color. It has ridges on the instep right there uh, to have precision and control. So great for receiving a pass. We have a nice rubber outsole for good traction on indoor and street, whichever one you want to go with. We have a mesh upper with a Nike skin overlay, a really nice flexible mesh upper. Um, we have an exposed midsole for lightweight responsiveness. This does not have been like an identified foam, it's just a Nike foam, um, but it's pretty cool looking. Um, we have an unequal lacing system that expands to the striking zone. So this kind of covers up the striking zone for like a laceless type feel, but again, it's not laceless. So you mostly will strike right here. So the lace is up there, the striking pad right there. We have a synthetic mesh on the lower half of the laces. Right there, nice stretchy synthetic mesh for nice hand on the ball. We have um, a synthetic leather lining to keep your heel locked in. Ooh, that looks really nice. You see that, guys? Right there. To keep your heel locked, a uh, heel locked in. So it's not like kind of like a rubber kind of feel, and so your foot won't be slipping out, even though this does not have a sock on it. And um, you know, academies, to be honest with you, usually aren't that durable. If I'm being that honest, um, if you can, I would get the pros, which is the highest end that Nike makes in indoors. But honestly, I've seen a lot of friends, and they haven't really had too much luck with academies or clubs. Um, just a lower end boot, but also. Um, I think it's a really nice boot. I just can't say it'll last as long as you want it to. But this one looks like a pretty high quality one. I'll be honest, more high quality than the other Academy boots I've seen. So, in the, so Nike is stepping up their game, but I do want to warn you guys on that. It's not going to last as long as you, as long as the um, pros one might do. So if you can stretch a little bit more of your budget to get the pros, I would. But these are still really nice and really cool. And I would highly recommend them. These are the one of the nicest academies I've ever seen through Nike. So Nike's stepping up their game, and I'm really liking this. It comes in, I'm not too bad, at 9.2 ounces. Uh, not really a speed boot either, but it does have that nice kind of heavier foam. So it's to be really comfortable. Trust me, guys. Um, I just really think it's a really nice one. Sorry, it's 9.2 ounces. If I said that wrong, 9.2 ounces right there. So yeah, there you go. I actually glue it in, but if you guys can kind of see right there, we have the Phantom Venom and then in the Mango Orange. So it's still a really cool, nice um, insole. It looks like just like the regular insole. It's not too thick, um, pretty thin, but still really nice. Guys, I'm going to be honest. These are one of the best accounting boots I've ever seen. Sometimes uh, the accounting boots from Nike can be very like low quality and fall apart really easily. I've, I've had other people have it from experience. But these are actually very high quality. And I think they're such a great uh, quality for the price. The, the gripping on the front isn't the best. It's a little slippery, but the passing pad is amazing for really great grip and really great control of the ball. The only thing I didn't really like was the tongue. I like the compression tongue on the... Uh, can, on the pros better instead of like the padded tongue but that's really just from preference and overall these boots were some of the best candy boots i've ever seen from nike i thought they were really comfortable and really close to the pros and i thought these were amazing for any ages because you know you can buy these for like smaller kids and i think these are just great boots and i 100 percent recommend you guys go check them out they're also on sale right now on soccer.com so guys go check them out link in description and yeah 100 percent recommend these boots Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. So I'm gonna get out.